Hello everyone. You saw the title. I always thought French toast was just a kind of toast. I recently discovered that French toast is actually what we call here pain perdu, which to me isn't the same at all. I think it's because of the way mum made the pain perdu back when I was a kid. So it was du parasi. She would put that in a, in a big stuff like this with milk, uh, sugar, sometimes chocolate chips, I think you say, and put that in the oven. And the goal was to not throw away the bread because we used to eat a lot of bread when I was a kid. Very French. <laughs> and so for me, toast, French toast is, you know, this very beautiful, fresh, pretty big slice of bread that you're gonna toast and that's all. But yeah, apparently this is this is the same in, in the world and I mean for other people. Nevertheless, I think both are good. And I also noticed that I never tried making French toast. Nor pain perdu, actually. Uh, and it's been a while since I ate pain perdu. I miss mom's food. So today I'm going to try that out. I'm going to try to make to make making French toast. And for that. About a few things, a boat, a boat, about a few things for that. As it's my first time, I wanted to experience a little, which is why I decided to go for three different types of bread. I just wanted to be a little wild. The first one is, I think, what everyone is using for, for the French toast. It's uh, the whole, whole bread, already sliced, things that you take for sandwich, for a lot of stuff actually. The second one is something a little more sweet. It's a cousin of, of the brioche, which isn't a brioche because it's better. It's what we call la gâche. I know people who know me personally, if they're watching this video, they're gonna laugh because almost everyone that I know know that I really love la gâche. The slices are a little bigger, thicker, and it's sweeter. And I wanted to taste that sweet part too, so. And the last one, as a French person, I wanted to taste French toast with a baguette. Which I know sounds probably weird for you, but for me it sounds like I gotta try it, you know. This baguette, I just actually just bought it two minutes ago at the local bakery down there. And I mean, it's still warm and fresh and crispy, I love it. So let's go, let's try. And, and uh, I don't know what to expect. Uh, I have a few stuff behind to put as a topping when I'm gonna have finished everything. I don't know how it's going to go. If you know me from a few videos before, you probably know that I'm not the best at cooking. It's not the best thing I can do in life, far away from that actually, but you know, I can manage sometime, sometimes. But what's important is that I'm trying today. So, as I never made French toast, I went on Google and wrote <laughs> how to make French toast. And a lot of recipes were very complete and detailed with sugar and milk and eggs and and here I thought you just had to put some butter and put it on the on that 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 stuff. How you call that by the way? A fry pan, I guess. A frying pan, yeah, on the frying pan. You know, to me it was just a slice of bread, some butter, you put here one minute, on the other way one minute, and it's a French toast. But apparently it's more, way more. Uh, complete than that. So I'm gonna go and try to choose from the thousands of recipes that are online, hoping that I'm gonna be able to choose a good one. So a lot of them have sugar in it and I will purposely not put any sugar in it because sugar is already everywhere. I mean, there's sugar in, in everything, even that. So beside the eggs, there is already sugar everywhere. So basically, it's it it looks it looks pretty simple. You just put the eggs with the milk and the sugar. So the thing that I'm not gonna do, and you can add whatever you want, some vanilla. I like this one, this one tells you to you do the eggs and you have the milk. You put the slices in the milk, then in the eggs, and while you do that. You have some butter in the frying pan, and then you put the slice uh, with milk and eggs on, on it, in the butter, and you fry it. I think this is a good way, so I'm gonna try that out. So I'm gonna make two of each to try with my boyfriend later, so look at this, so I have 
six of them. So eggs are done. Heaven. You know guys, I don't think French toast is really a thing here in France. I really think it is a popular thing, but over the years, like in the States or in the UK, for example. But I really don't think French toast is a thing here, to be honest. But <laughs> the other day, I read an article when I was, you know, looking for, for information for this video. I read an article about uh, but the fact that it's used, you know, overseas and especially in the restaurant as it's so like French toast, is, it's a fancy way to say it. Like it allows restaurant to add one or two dollar more to the prices. It's all about marketing. So it was fun, you know, hearing about that. I mean, reading about that. And you know, the worst, I guess, it's that even though it's not a thing here in France. Well, French restaurants, especially in Paris or in the very touristic areas, they still have it on their menu. Cause you know, I'm, I'm going to Paris at least once or twice a month uh, to do some stuff usually. Recently I've been hanging out with Guillaume that you saw in the interviews. And so we always, you know, go to a coffee, coffee shop or restaurant and I always see French toast on the menu and it's hell expensive. And I'm like, it's not even a thing in France. But you know, they, they know, they know. So of course they're gonna put it on, um, on their menu because they're gonna make money with that. <sighs> Beautiful day again today. So I have my eggs, I have my milk. Now I guess I can put some butter in the frying pan and do that. So, well, the butter is, is frying or, or melting or whatever. I'm gonna, I'm gonna start by, uh, I guess, doing the stew and the stew and the stew. Ugh. I have no idea what I'm doing right now. And then you put that on the eggs? Really? Okay. Ah, I hate that kind of, of a, ah. <gasps> it's gonna broke though. Let's try with the stew first, I guess. Ah, okay. So I'm guessing that's how you do. I'm hoping that's how you do. I think it's a little too, you know, too moving. I don't know how to say that. So the problem I have right now is I think the toast are right, way too, blah, 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 you know, <laughs> I don't know how to say that. You know, to me, toast should be strong, you know, they should hold together, you know, like the bread and all. But it seems like with all this milk and, and, uh, and eggs, I mean, I'm not sure what I'm doing right now. Ah, I burned it. One eternity later. So, I'm back. 
with the disaster. Okay, I don't know guys, I think it's, it is a disaster. It does look okay, I guess, but I don't know, in my mind, toast should be, you know, like they're completely... I mean, I'm gonna need a fork and a knife to eat them. I'm not gonna be able to eat them with my hands because they completely fall apart. But well, so this is a baguette, this is the gash and that's the, uh, the bread. Now I guess it's time to taste it, to eat that. Uh, so for that, I have some sucre glace. How do you say that in English? I don't know, but you may recognize that. I have some maple syrup, syrup, maple syrup, I don't know how you say that, from Michigan, straight from Michigan. It was sent by one of you guys. Thank you so much if, you, uh, if you're watching this video. I really love it. As you can see, I drink a lot, I mean, ate a lot of it. I choose my, one of my mom's jam. It's uh, red fruits. I don't know how you say that in it. It's prune, but I don't know how you say that in English, but I love it. Thanks, mom. And I got some fresh red fruits too. I have no idea how I'm supposed to eat that. Uh, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my plate. I'm going to take some one of them uh, and tr try them out. And I need a fork. Okay, so let me test the, the baguette first because I really want to try this one first. Oh. Let me try it first like like this and then I'm going to add some stuff. It smells really good. Oh my god, that's awesome. That's awesome. I thought it was a disaster. Oh my god! <gasps> this is so good! Wow! I'm so proud of myself right now! <laughs> oh my god, this is so good! It's really good! Wow, okay! Wow, 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 wow! It's, it's just so good! Um, okay, I'm gonna taste all of them raw, you know, just to have a objective point of view of them because if I add some stuff, it's not gonna be objective anymore. So let me take a bite of the gash. Oh, with the sweet side. Yes, this is amazing. There is a flavor in this particular type of brioche, better than brioche told you, that I really like. And with what I just did, it enhances this flavor a lot more. So, wow, I just love it. Okay, let's taste the last one. So this is the whole bread. Mm. 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 It's good, it's good. Oh, okay, oh, it's a lot different. Because that's more salty than salty than this one, so yeah, it's a, uh, it's different, but it's 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 really good too. I mean, it really depends on what you like. No, it's great. You can do a lot of different stuff. Wow, amazing! I love it. Well, now I guess I'm gonna do some decorations. So you can do your entrance. Entrance is. Uh... Entrée, I guess. I guess. I don't know. Go in the video. <laughs> My head is uh, cut. Ah, uh, yeah, because you're too tall. Yes. But the thing is. Good like this. <laughs> so I actually taste this one, tasted this one with the camera. My battery died, so you didn't see it, but this is awesome. And I'm guessing, you know, with the jam and everything is gonna be awesome. So, yeah, this is a diet battery. Um, now we're gonna. Je vais goûter avec ce bébé. Donc ça c'est le pain, c'est du pain de la boulangerie. Et dessus j'ai mis du sirop d'érable avec quelques fruits rouges. Tu veux goûter les deux D'accord, bah vas-y. T'as l'air fier de ta création. Yeah. Moi c'est bon. C'est bon Moi j'aime bien, ouais. T'aimes bien mmh. Et après, tu peux mettre de la confiture à maman ou du sucre glace, tout ce que tu veux dessus. Je peux en prendre Avec plaisir, vas-y. Je vais... Euh... 
<rire> Merci. Bye bye. Mal choix, you good. You want to make me happy? Just give me good food. I'm just gonna try to do something with this wine. I'm guessing strawberry and some jam and... Thanks, ma'am. I think it's gonna be really good too. Wow. Well. This is way too good. This is delicious. I'm so proud of myself, actually. And it's great because, I mean, yeah, it wasn't what I, what I was expecting, you know, as a texture. But the, the, the flavor is, is, is wonderful. I will leave you here, guys. I'm gonna eat everything, probably, but, you know, out of, out of your sight. Thank you so much for watching. I had a lot of fun doing that. I'm glad that I experienced something something new uh, with you and yeah i finally made french toast as a french woman that's great thank you for watching i will see you very soon bye mm.